Cicadas everywhere. Do you want to hear the sound of summer? Mark my words. You will experience it in a bit. What does a cicada sound like? Individually, a cicada sounds like a tiny maraca, shaken at high speed that then fades into a noise resembling an electric buzz. In large groups, the sound of cicadas can reach as high as 100 decibels and have been compared to the sound of electricity in some cases. Get ready! Let's hear the loud buzzing sound of cicadas now. Hope you didn't reduce your volume. So, how and why do cicadas make noise? Using a special structure on their abdomen known as a timbal, these insects produce a loud buzzing sound that is typically utilized to attract mates. Amazing! Isn't it? Let's explore more about Brood X periodical cicadas. Periodical cicadas, sometimes referred to as 17-year cicadas, are large, flying insects that are known for the loud buzzing noise that males make to attract female mates. What does a cicada look like? Periodical cicadas typically have black bodies, orange wing veins, red eyes, and six legs. They also have antennae and are typically one to two inches in length. Annual cicadas, which emerge each year, are black and green. What do cicadas do? Above ground, cicadas only live for a few weeks, during which they mate. The female cuts V-shaped slits in the bark of young twigs and lays about 20 eggs in each, for a total of 600 or more eggs. After approximately 6 to 10 weeks, the eggs will hatch and the nymphs will drop to the ground, burrowing into the ground to feed and develop for the next 13 to 17 years. What do cicadas eat? During their time underground, cicadas primarily feed on the juices and sap of tree roots. Once above ground, adults may feed on plant juices which can cause minimal damage to trees. How long do cicadas live? Above ground, cicadas only live for a few weeks. So, where do cicadas live? Periodical cicadas spend the majority of their lives underground. When they emerge, they typically seek out trees where they can feed on sap and lay eggs in slits that the females cut on the ends of small branches. When it comes to where cicadas are found as far as geographic presence, Brood X in particular is expected to affect 15 different states in eastern United States. Within this region, there are different groups called broods that emerge on different 17-year cycles. Amazing! Isn't it? Well, let me introduce my new quack quack buddy, whom I met while exploring the sound of summer. Here comes my quack quack buddy. Let's experience the sound of cicadas along with the buddy. Here we go. Hey buddy, are the cicadas troubling you? No. Good to know. Another common cicada question is about whether or not they are dangerous. Although they may be loud, periodical cicadas are only considered nuisance pests. They do not bite or sting and generally do not pose any health threats to humans. In areas of high concentrations of cicadas, they can cause cosmetic damage to trees when they lay their eggs on young tree branches. However, they actually provide a number of different benefits to nature. Cicadas can serve as food for many animals, including birds, reptiles, snakes, and even spiders. When underground, the nymphs construct tunnels that help to aerate the soil and allow for tree roots to get more access to nutrients and oxygen for growth. Amazing, isn't it? Thanks for watching my video on the Brood X periodical cicadas, the sound of summer. Don't miss my making video. Stay tuned.